All right, here we go, y'all. So these are the blackout messages. Uh, I asked the question to spirit, you know, what are we all fighting for? What is it that, you know, over the years we have been fighting for? Um, and I asked my spirit guides and my ancestors, and they really wanted me to uh, put this out as a collective message. We are all trying to find our true authenticity. We're trying to find our originality. Uh, we're trying to be authentic. We're, we're finding our authenticity, like I said. And I definitely feel like with that, we are also finding our individualism as well. Uh, we're learning how to speak up for ourselves. We're learning how to be direct and open and honest with each other. Uh, we're also learning and fighting for our voice and allowing ourselves to transform in spirituality as well. So I definitely feel with that, we are fighting for a new beginning. That's what we're fighting for right now um, and throughout the whole, like, all of our lives, okay, until, like, since the beginning of the creator world, <laughs> the universe, since the beginning of the universe, we are all fighting to raise above any low vibrations, okay? I definitely feel like... um in the middle of all of this, we have closed ourselves off to be able to look on the brighter side of things. So I definitely feel like um, there is split personalities out there as well. Um, feeling like you can't voice your opinion or feeling like you can't um, see things uh, differently or um, there's just this mask, this veil that has been placed over um, everyone's eyes, okay? And I definitely feel like because that has been placed over our eyes, we feel like we're not able to move, all right? But there's nothing that's stopping us. So what Spirit wants to say is that, you know, when you unveil that, that mask from over your eyes, you are able to see so much clearer. Because I do see like the next step is moving towards victory, moving towards success, being your true authentic self. I definitely feel like with things that are going on as far as now, there's been definitely things to cover that up. There's things that make you uh, think split things like you want to do something, but then there's that thing that doesn't make you or like um, just negative thoughts as well. Um, I definitely feel like there is a whole world out there, but um, because we feel so stuck and captivated into our own mind that we're not able to physically move, we're not able to make any decisions for ourselves. And I definitely feel like we are fighting to break free from that to look on the brighter side of every single aspect of every single person so that we can move forward with victory and success as a whole okay as a whole to move together forward as a whole to be your true authentic self now I definitely feel uh, what we are also fighting for is um, being able to move towards calmer waters okay you're fighting for intuitive um, you know calmer feelings taking care of your needs emotionally and just finding that balance with your mind body and spirit um, within your emotions. I am seeing a lot of crowns here. A lot of people want to wear the crown, but they don't know how to properly use it is what I'm seeing. I also see that what we are fighting for is to collaborate. Um, collaboration is key. Communication is key. Working together is key. Mastering your own skill, but also the ability to teach others as well. Okay, so that's what we're really um, focused on, but a lot of people can't see that. A lot of people in the higher up realm don't see, or I'm sorry, not the higher up realm, the higher ups is what I'm going to call them, the corporate quote-unquote heads. They don't see 
you know, in order to wear the crown. Like, there's all these crowns that people want to wear, but they don't know how to collaborate with people. They don't know how to um, speak properly to each other, all right? Um, they don't know how to be honest. They don't know how to be direct. Or I definitely feel like the direct part, but, like, they're being quite harsh about it, and they're not going about it the right way. I definitely feel like there is a whole bunch of distractions uh, collectively to keep you from your true authentic self. Um, there's a whole bunch of materialistic things out there, definitely uh, snakes out there as well, deceptives out there, people to reel you in into not knowing your own spirituality, all right? And I definitely feel like that's the mask that was um, put on you to keep you from seeing, um, to keep you distracted. And I definitely feel like as a collective, we are going to repair this damage. Um, it just takes baby steps. It really, really does, you know, to connect the mind, body, and spirit to actually physically wear that crown and be true and authentic with it. And I definitely feel like there is going to be a new beginning where we all as a collective um, dive deep into our passions, our sole purpose, um, uh, the fire that burns within us to wear this crown with dignity is the words okay allowing source energy to flow through you to provide that fire within you to keep being that powerful leader to keep collaborating with people um, I definitely feel like the fight is to what we're all fighting for is to wear that crown but not truly knowing that we already do Okay, those are the messages. We already wear the crown. It's just up to us to do the work to uh, unlift that veil from our eyes to be in our absolute power to get downloads from source energy and just continue to, you know, have that confidence and that courage within ourselves to keep doing good things. I definitely feel like we are divinely guided. It's just up to us to take care of our needs, to focus on ourselves and our emotions. It's up to us to connect our mind, body, and spirit, like I said, to wear that crown with dignity, with respect, with powerful, like, leadership. I definitely feel like everybody, like I said, wants to wear the crown. Everybody wants to um, have loyal people around them, but there is some uh, split personalities or split decisions that are keeping us from that, okay? Those distractions out there. I definitely feel like um, once you unveil that mask and you are able to think clearly is what I'm hearing, you'll be able to raise yourself to a much higher vibration. It's almost as if you are floating, okay? Um, you will definitely raise your vibrations to know your soul purpose, to be connected with divine, to really know your true authenticity, to be direct and open and honest with yourself, um, but to also shed off that um, cold, bitter heart from what also has been done so that you can move forward, okay? So those are the collective messages today. I hope this resonates with at least majority of you. If it doesn't, I'm sorry this message wasn't for you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below. Much love and light-headed your way. Take care.